Prince Jachike. Um, who? Sorry, how did you get my number? What? Um, please, please, please. I am not in the right frame of mind for any drama, okay? Whatever, bye. You've been like this all day. And you know this is not good for your health, right? 1040 feet container worth millions of dollars. Gone just like that. Gone in the twinkle of an eye. How did I not see this coming? I know. The containers are gone, yes. The money is also gone, I know that. But you're not gone. You're here. And you will bounce back. You definitely will. My hard work. My blood and sweat. Everything I have worked for. Where do I go from here? How do I pay back the loan? 
What do I do when the banks come calling? How do I pay them back? Honey, you will pay them back. I'm finished. You're not. I'm gone. Stop saying this, you're not. You're the one who made this money. You will make it again and even more. You will bounce back, okay? You will. How do I pay back the loan? I'm finished. No, you're not. Suicide is the only option. Honey, how can you say things like that? Suicide can never be an option. Honey, this is the time you need to be strong. You need to be strong for me. For us. Every problem has a solution. So we will definitely find a solution. And you're not alone, okay? I'm here. And always will be. Hmm? It's okay, it's not the end of the world. Come on. Don't be too hard on yourself, please. Something to do with everything. How? We're talking about pa here, baby girl. Pa. What's pa? That means power, affluence, and royalty. All in one package. Um, he's fair in complexion and handsome too. I know. But why are you telling me all this? What about Kachi? Ka what? Huh. The Bible said old things have passed away and new things has begun. Hmm? Kachi is former and Prince Jachike is the letter. I don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm confused. Because the truth is, yes, the prince is handsome. And I fell for him the first day. Mm -hmm. But I'm just thinking about Kachi. I know what you feel. I know what you're thinking. But I just want you to forget about him. You said it yourself that his situation is hopeless. Is that where you want to be? No. I guess not. I'm just looking for the perfect reason to leave him. Then you're on a perpetual search. Because there is no such perfect reason. I mean, Kachi is in the red. And Prince Yachike is the big upgrade. Baby girl, think. This is the survival of the fittest. You have to use your head.
tell him anything that will make him believe. He will definitely understand. He won't understand. He won't understand, Emperor. Do you think it's that easy? It's not. And don't you think it's too early to leave him? I'm concerned about what people will say. People will always say. They will always talk, no matter the condition. They will talk, but I love him. See, let me tell you, whether you leave him today, tomorrow, next tomorrow, it is better you leave him now, so why wait? You still the same thing, you know? so why wait? You may be right. Yes, I'm always. Listen, Ju. It is not your fault that he has gone bankrupt. Hmm? Allow him face the reality of life. Mm. You can't do anything about it. So why stress yourself? Why is she not taking my call? Why is she not taking my call? She's avoiding my call.
love and riches, love and riches, love and riches. Yes, I am. Please, what exactly happened to him? I am not sure, Ma, but the man that brought him here said he walked into his car. He walked into a man's car? Yes. Hey, I, I think he's depressed. Depressed? How did you come to that conclusion? No, no, it's not a conclusion, Ma. I am just making a mere speculation because of what the man that brought him said. He said he was walking on the road aimlessly and absent-minded and then suddenly he slumped and fell on his car. Hey! But the doctor will see him and finalize everything. Oh, okay. In that case, I have to see the doctor. Yes, but do excuse me, I will get the doctor. Okay, thank you very much. I'm sorry if I did. Okay. Um, what's that look on your face? I'm just not comfortable doing this. I'm not comfortable at all. And what if he thinks I dressed up for him? No, he wouldn't. Besides, he didn't know you were aware of my deals with him. So you see, I told him you're going for a quiet time at the beach. So you see, he won't suspect a thing. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. Just pretend. You don't know he's coming here. Okay? Break time. And he will never ever suspect anything. Just be going, it's calling. Alright, alright. Good night. Okay. Wish me luck. Good luck.
Hello, beautiful. What are you doing here? I told you I would come, didn't I? You obviously don't give up, do you? No, I don't. Especially because of what I feel. I feel love. Love? Isn't that too early to say that? Well, you can call it that. Perhaps. But I feel what I feel and that's how I feel. There is nothing I can do about it. I feel really powerless right now. I see. Masi, hi. Um, Masi, meet Prince Jachiki, the crown prince of Ibolo Kingdom. And this is my friend, Masi. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. You okay? Um, yes, I'm fine. Would you, I'll, I'll be inside. Who's she? My friend. Nice girl. Beautiful. Okay. What's with that? What's with what? Are you feeling a little jealous? Over what? Yeah, I mean, I saw the look on your face when I said she's beautiful. She's no more beautiful than you are, though. So, hey. Charming. Yes. Yes. <laughs> like right now? As a matter of fact, that's why I came here. Literally. Hmm. So don't say no. Okay. So how would you take a no? Ah. Even if you said no. It's not going to make a difference to me. You know why? Because I'm programmed to hear a yes. So if you said no, I will still hear a yes. You might as well just say a yes. Look, I was actually going to the beach for a quiet time. But let's see how it goes. So, yes. That's my girl. Now you're coming around. Come this way. This way. You have seen that bread things don't come easily. Anybody who desires great things must be ready to work for it. You can fold your hand and expect manna to fall from heaven. You must pray, you must walk for it, prayers without work, it's like dead body, oh, love and riches, oh, love and riches. Yo, Mr. Mika, how are you? My head aches, mm? and I feel dizzy. It's understandable. But that is why I am here to make you feel better. Hope you'll be eating. Hmm? No. I've not. No? No. I thought your friend was going to get food for you. Yeah, she did. But I haven't seen her. I guess she went to the house to get the food. It's been over an hour. I mean, you know what? Why don't you give me her number? Let me try to call her myself, if you don't mind. Okay. Okay. Zero, zero. Yes. Five, three. Okay. Two, seven. Two, seven. Two, one. Two, one. Nine, five. Nine, five.
No, Richie, no. Let me just try it again. Still no reachable. It's time for your injections. What are we going to do? to keep it. I mean, I can, I could go and come back. No, I'm not eating. Sure. Yeah, of course. And that reminds me, I messaged your friend, but he hasn't delivered yet. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. Nasvivo, thank you very much for everything. You're welcome. <laughs> Time for you. Injection. You'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Why don't you open your mouth and talk? Why are you silent? That's because I don't know what you want me to say. Of course you know what I'm talking about. What is going on? What is going on where? There, please don't give me I don't understand look because obviously you know what I'm talking about really yes what if I tell you that I don't understand what you were talking about maybe you should try and refresh it okay <laughs> it's all right keep playing dumb you still tell me who this Prince Charming is. Really? If you say so. <laughs> oh my god. That's okay. <laughs> you find it hilarious. <laughs> Let me take this opportunity to officially introduce myself. My name is Prince. Mm -hmm. The crown prince of Igbo looking. Hmm. Officially. Officially. And I am not a comedian. Oh. <laughs> Just needed to add that. But you know, right? You can actually add that title to your name. Mm -hmm. A comedian. Because you are super funny. I mean, I can't stop laughing. <laughs> well, fortunately, Comedy and royalty have nothing in common. But I don't mind taking up that title if it makes you happy. <laughs> On the condition that I will perform for only you, just you, no one else. Hmm. And you just delivered a sweet line. She finally pays me a compliment. Oh, so you were waiting for it, right? Forever. <laughs> Four years now. <laughs> well, you deserve it. I'm actually really pleased to know that you find my words sweet. Of course they are. I mean, not just your words. You also have a sweet personality. And I have really enjoyed your compliments so far. Same here. 
Same here. I think that's the more reason why we need to be together. Don't you think? I mean, we have a lot in common so far. Mm. So do you have a boyfriend? plan on killing my battery. I don't think I will see you today. What? Look, look, look. I don't have strength for this argument. I don't have strength for it. Fine, I will come in the evening. Bye. Is there a problem? Who is the caller? Um. It's fine, it's, it's not someone you should bore yourself with. Well, the person makes you unhappy. Clearly you're unhappy. And for me, that's a concern. <coughs> Sorry, <coughs> it's okay. Thank you. I'm fine, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's... Can we change the subject? I mean, talk about something else. Please? Yeah, sure. If it makes you happy, why not? I'm at your service. <laughs> so maybe this is the best time to jump into my clown outfit and perform for you. <laughs> so what would you want? Stage act or... Hmm. Let me think about this one. Okay. I'm sorry for not bringing the food earlier. I was... Babe, it's okay. You owe me no explanation. You have already done enough. And I really appreciate you. Does that mean you've eaten? Yes. Um, Nosefa brought me food. You know, she was calling your number, but your number was not connecting. So she had to do something. Oh, yes, I saw her message. That was so kind of her. Well, I... I saw the doctor on my way here and he told me that you are good to go. Mm -hmm. Now, so I said the same thing to me. But I'm here to see the doctor. Hey, you don't need to worry. I'll see the doctor myself, okay? I'll be right back. Welcome to my home. Thank you. Nice place. Thank you. Well, thank you so much for today. I mean, I had so much fun. I'm elated. I'm elated that you had fun, mm -hmm. honestly. Of course I did. And you know, the good thing is, it's not just about you. It's the, the vibe, the whole ambiance about you, your personality. Ah, oh, man. I really shag hanging out with you today, honestly, yeah. I did. Of course you should. I mean, I'm not surprised. I am beautiful, elegant. I am loved and appreciated by everyone. 
So it's normal having fun with me. <laughs> Self-felicitation. And you're so confident about it. Of course I am. I like that. <laughs> I like that. I asked you a question earlier. And I haven't gotten a response. Do you mind giving me a response now? Can you give me some time? Then I'll give you an answer. I just need a little time. Okay, <laughs> that's fine. I am a man of patience. Good. That's one of my virtues. Good. So you have all the time in the world. Take your time, no rush, no pressure, okay? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so I guess I'll see you some other time. Yeah, sure, why not? Okay. Good night. Good night. Good night. Hey, what? Very. <laughs> You've started with this your creepy attitude. <laughs> no, mm. my friend, you know, you have to forget about this my creepy attitude. Mm. And we'll talk about it later. But for now, you need to tell me what happened. What really happened? I need to know. <laughs> Do you know you're actually behaving like a child? Mm. Mm. Really? So you want to keep the gist to yourself? It's okay. I'll tell you. Okay. I enjoyed myself. <laughs> I mean, I had fun. Really? Prince Kachi is Prince Kachi. Oops, I meant Prince Jachi King, okay. not Kachi. <laughs> He's a whole vibe. Mm. He has this dominating aura around him. Mm -hmm. I mean, in a romantic way. Uh -huh. And I think I like that about him. Uh oh, my girl is in love. Who wouldn't be? Tell me, who <laughs> wouldn't be? Hey, Prince Jachi King has it all. He's handsome. Mm -hmm. He's super rich, mm -hmm. he's funny, uh -huh. and he is fun to be with. Tell he me is more. fun to be with. <laughs> I mean, so falling in love with someone like that is just so easy and natural. I don't even have to fuss it. Oh, I'm so happy for you. <laughs> you said it. We we'll talk about money, <laughs> riches, wealth. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Girl, Mercy, why is your face so dull? Mercy, did anything happen? Mercy. How do you feel now? Mm. I'm fine. I feel better and strong now. Okay. Well, I've seen the doctor. Medically, he said you're okay. That you're very strong. He has discharged you. I have equally paid the bills. Yes. But it's time for us to draw the line. Erika. I have tried. I have tried to make this relationship work. And I can't see anything coming out of it. Nothing at all. So I think it's best Take a break. Mm. I understand you. Trust me, I'll be a fool or an angry if I don't understand you. But I'm begging you. I'm begging you in the name of God. Please don't leave me. Please, just give me some time. Time! Time, you said, Emeka. 
For how long am I going to give you this time? You've been asking for time from the very beginning of this relationship. I don't have time anymore. I'm tired. I understand. I truly understand you. But to be honest, babe, I'm trying. God knows that I'm trying. It's just that things have not been easy for me. Things haven't been easy for me either. I've made up my mind on this. And there is no going back. I'll see you to your house. And that's it. I'm sorry. I'll be outside. Wait. Mercy, is this why you're crying? Really? Come on, girl. You're bigger than this now. Yes, Masi. I think Eberi is right. I'm always right. Yes, because this is long overdue. And I don't see any reason why you should cry over this. Masi, you want me to be rude? Really? You really want me to be rude? You did the right thing. But you're now behaving so childish and stupid. Instead of you to celebrate, you're here crying like a fool. You girls don't understand. It is not easy as you think. I wish I did the right thing. I hope I just hope I did the right thing. You did the right thing. You did the right thing. In fact, I think you deserve an Oscar award for staying this long. That guy almost wrecked you. He almost sucked you dry. Girl, you need to wake up. Hamasi, if you think you didn't do the right thing, so why did you then do it? Eberi, that's enough. No, it is not enough. Mama is always a joy killer, and it's high time I put it to her face. It should have been a double celebration, but yet she ruined it with her bad energy. Look, I understand you. But maybe she didn't do the right thing by crying. But I think I understand her point. And it's only right for her to feel this way. So just let her be. Yeah, I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. You have your dirty mouth. You can say whatever you like. So, Mama, seriously, not a maker of a guy is so shameless. So he actually planned feeding off your pocket without doing anything. Now you see what I was telling you. You see? Ebi, I think I'm, I'm part of his problem. How? He's so obvious. I spoon fed him and that made him lose focus. No. On the contrary. He is a manipulative, lazy boom who saw kind nature and decided to exploit it. Very shameless man. Shameless and hopeless. So. But I love him. I really love him, Mecca, so much. I just hope what you're saying is not true. Because I will hate him with my whole heart. Oh, it's okay. The most important thing is that the ties between both of you is broken. That is the more important thing. And my best advice to you is for you to move on. Move on! And a better man will come, not a good dick. That's my friend. That's all I have to give to you. That's all I have to offer. You left me when I needed you most. I thought you loved me. Why?
Emeka, what are you doing here? What's all this embarrassment? It's not an embarrassment though. I've been waiting for you at your gate since. See, Masi, I want us to talk about something. About what? Masi, I know I have not lived up to your expectations. I know I have not contributed anything financially in this relationship. But trust me, Masi, I'm optimistic. Emeka, do you know your problem? Your problem is that you are lazy. For how long are you going to live in the illusion of I will make it, I will make it, and yet nothing is coming out from it? What is it? Emeka, how long are you going to eat my life ain't service? Year by year you've been eating my money. Are you a man at all? Just look at yourself. Are you a man? I am. And I will prove it to you. Okay, let's do it this way. Okay, Masi, I promise not to seek for any financial assistance from you again. How do you see it? <laughs> hey, God. You're smarter than this guy. You're smarter than this now. Come on. No, Masi, that's not true. As a matter of fact, you are my source of encouragement, too. Hmm. Only that way. You are the source of my encouragement. Masi, you are not hindering me. How are you hindering me now? Eh? You are not hindering me. Please. Please, don't, don't say this. Um, seriously, I love you. I am not going to dispute the fact that I do. But, you need to move on. It is not easy for me either. But you need to move on. Just go. Let me be. Move on with your life. Concentrate on your life and let me be for now, please. I, I just need a break. I don't want to see you again. Don't come to my gate again. Don't follow me again. I, don't touch me, Emeka. Don't. I am serious this time. Out of my way. Masi. Masi, please now. Oh my love, on your phone I know A bugini kamere iji kwa wamo bimo How could you do this to me? Oh You've been hearing me shout your name. Uh, when? I've been calling your name, but you, you were ignoring me. I didn't ignore you. I didn't hear you calling me. Ah, you must be lost in thoughts. Are you okay? Come, let's go. Ah, please come back. Come back. Come back. Come back home. I'm okay. You were lost. That's what you did. Yeah, I was, I was thinking. Okay. Eyes work. It was fine, huh? Kachi, I am trying so hard to understand you. Did you ask me to come to your house just so you knock? Is that it? Would you? Why are you trying so hard to change the topic of our discussion? Why? And what does that mean? I only asked you a simple question. Why are you not taking my calls? No, tell me. You know my problem with you. Everything is about you, 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 and no one else. Do you even care to know how hard it has been for me for the past few weeks? Do you care? Of course not. Because you are so selfish. So how am I supposed to know what you've been through? When was the last time you visited me? The last time I called you, you refused to take my calls. And when you finally returned my calls, you promised to visit me, but you never did. Why must I always be the one to visit you? Why? Why can't you come by to my house? Why can't you visit me too? Uju? What? Mm-hmm. Try. 
such a touching story. But my question is, why did she have to leave you when you needed her the most? Hmm? It's not her fault. She really tried for me. Even against her friend's wish. I guess the pressure is becoming too much that she could no longer handle it. And she had to break up with you on your sick bed. But I was not sick. I only suffered shock and a little bit depressed. But we're saying the same thing. It wasn't a good time for her to break up with you now. No. I was fine when she said goodbye. Besides, she paid the hospital bill. Masi Chupu. A beautiful girl with a beautiful soul. You know, this is actually my fault. No! No, it's not your fault. It's the society that supports mediocrity instead of supporting innovative minds like yours that is to be blamed here, not you. Anyway, do not let it deter you, okay? You must believe in your dreams because they are valid. Thank you. You're welcome. And you have to stop overthinking. Stay positive. Everything will be fine. Alright? This is my stall. I stay here whenever I'm not working or I'm off duty. Feel free to come around anytime. Alright? Chill. Would you? I've been meaning to have this discussion with you, but I have been trying to put myself together. What has come over you? Nothing. Hmm? I just don't want to suffer. Simple. Oh, really? You don't want to suffer. So your fuels has been going through financial crisis and all you could do is to jump into another man's arms immediately. What would you have me do? No, tell me, what would you have me do? You want me to commit suicide because of Kachi's stupidity? No, I wouldn't do that. He brought this upon himself because of his greed. And I am not ready to share in that thing. Can you hear yourself? No, look at the way you're talking about a man that has been there for you. This guy has been supportive. This guy has been caring. Just look at the way you're talking about him. He doesn't deserve this. Where is your conscience, Yuju? Mercy. Mas, I don't understand you. I don't really understand your points here. Eh? What has come over you? In fact, what is your edict in this matter? Oh, oh. please, oh. help me ask her. Help me would ask you, her. Would you rather enjoy or see your friends suffering in the name of love? Maybe that's her plan. No, that's what she wants. You know, she has been there before. So she also wants me to go there. But let me tell you something, eh? It will not work. And come to think of it, were you not the same person that left your man because he's a broke ass? Didn't you do that? What is your problem? You and I know that our case is different. This guy in question, I have been the one taking care of him from the day one of the relationship. Besides, you girls advised me to leave him. And that is the same advice I expect you to give me. I mean, we tried to save you, but look at you trying to get me stalked. Your plan will not work. This is different with you. Mm. Yes. <laughs> it's not the same thing. Mm -hmm. Masiko, what is really your problem? What is your problem? Hala how to rest. Someone just got back from work. You will let her rest. Please, I don't even have time for all this. I'm tired and I need to freshen up. Okay? Please, I need to go and freshen up. I don't have time for you. You need it. Oh. You need it. Eh? You don't have to be pessimistic. There is still hope. Hope? I can't find any to hold on to. You can hold on to your life. You can hold on to God. I know it's not easy at all. But remember, it's never impossible. You can do it. You can rise up again. Okay? It's not easy. 
Do you know how much is involved? Including borrowed funds? I understand. But would you rather remain on the ground just because you have fallen? I may not be in your condition. 